Hello, Takamasak here. Welcome back to the Enchanted Cave. Now, between episodes, I did maybe three or four runs up to... I got as far as floor 19, and I don't know what of this is new since last episode. I think I got the Eye of the Earth, like, my last run through, and then the Brass Knuckles uh, artifacts the run before that. I don't know if I had the Steel Plate Leggings yet or not, but you can see my total boosts here not finding very many of I think these are speed and then I got a couple of more achievements I got obviously you get the achievement for getting the eye of the earth uh, I got to apparently I got to floor 20 according to this I got the mr. money bags achievement for holding 1,000 gold 10,000 gold holy Jesus and yeah I think that's pretty much it maybe I no, I'm pretty sure I got this on screen but let us go down I will uh, the thing is once you get to it seems like the multiple of nines are, or the floors that end in nine, they are the floors where you run into this shop. And as always, you're going to end up uh, taking all of your artifacts over. And once you get to 19, floor nine becomes your starting point. So I don't, I don't know if that's necessarily super helpful. I don't have a very good item to buy this time. Yeah, at least you start with all your gold. Ooh, that is very high defense. So I'll take one of you. And I might as well buy something somewhat useful. Uh, oh, I kept my magic too? Ah, huh. I didn't know that. Apparently when you find magics, you can bring those along with you. I didn't know. I, th I figured it was really dead set on all this, all this artifact stuff. Like, you can only take artifacts over, but... Uh, yeah, obviously, Water Strike, 100% Water Elemental. So really all I was doing is I have the Eye of Wealth. I guess it's going to be random which one you guys get, but I'll just kind of look at stuff. Uh, the Escape Wings, you always want to get immediately. Oh, my damage is so terrible. I need to find a, one of these uh, contains random item. What do you mean random item? What the hell is a random item? Oh. Piece of garbage. And even a bigger piece of garbage. At least I can put that to you. So. so there's not really too much of a point in... I was going to say killing everything. I, I don't know yet. I haven't fully got the grasp of this game yet. Like I said, it's been ages since I've gone through this demon. So it seems like what I was about to say that... Uh, with the floors, it didn't look like there was a way to start over back from floor one, and I don't know if it is... What's in here? Leg armor, I don't need that. I don't know if it's necessarily better to not hit floor 19, just so you can make runs and collect, uh, collect any gems that might be on the easier one through nine floors. So maybe it's a better idea to do that. Then again, maybe a hey, legendary chest. Does it say it contains it? Ooh, it contains a ring. So at least I oh, I have to go over here anyway to get the silver gem. And we get the eye of oceans. Allows the ear to see the water stats. I don't know if I'm ever really gonna pay any attention to that. Can I? Oh, I can see before. So he's got five water resist. I don't know if it's. Oh yeah, it's totally worth it. So you just drag and drop and. Sploosh! I didn't even see how much damage that did. I wasn't paying attention. So I don't know. I guess you can kind of take a look. It's like, oh, he's got zero water resistance. Let's uh, murder him. It does take a little longer to cast, obviously, but what is your? You've got also five water resistance. So if if you have a terrible weapon like I do to start off with, I guess I guess that would be the better way to go until you find a decent weapon. What is it? You have zero water resist also. It doesn't say his hit points. Maybe I'll get something later that says the hit points. But uh, Let's see. So, one of my bigger advices of this game is to not take any risks. So, you'll, it's very good at giving you the wings of escape within... There's nothing in here that I need. Uh, within a reasonable amount of monster kills. So, either way, I gotta go through three. Or, uh... It gives you the wings of escape. It's very good about giving it to you early enough to where it's not unreasonable for you to get it, but it, 
might seem like if you were rolling the dice and you were struggling with monsters, but you managed to get to, say, I'm assuming floor 29 or floor 30, whichever it sets the next checkpoint at, you might be able to... I can't say for sure, because like I said, it's been ages since I've played this, but you might be able to accidentally dick yourself if you got so far and then you were really struggling with the... Uh, with the monsters at that point. So I guess just take a little bit of care there. Is there nothing I really need here. So the health potions are absurdly expensive. They're like 350? I do need a weapon. I do need body armor also. Every time it takes me a second to find myself. I'm like, where the hell am I? Ugh. And, oh, is that one of those things again? Oh, it's the murder weapon, all right. That thing is absolutely murderous. Oh! Oh! oh. Pardon me! So let's. Eh, there's only. Either way, I'm going through Skellington. Alright, so. Oh, these guys are rough. Does it show. No, it doesn't show their attack either. Damn. So I need. What do I need? Anything? Hat and armor. There is none of that on this floor. So let's just murder Skellington and go down. I guess there's going to be a reasonable amount of farming in this game. Oh, there's two helmets here. Is it worth going through all that? No, not necessarily. And we get the fire amulet. Offers protection. There's nothing really using fire yet. Yeah, none of these guys have a fire elemental attack. Do these guys have... No, there aren't any anymore. I was gonna see if those other guys had any had like an earth elemental. Hey, I see you. Oh, I see you too. Pay very close attention to where the gems are because I think I had it twice on my third run off screen where I hit the floor and then I or I hit the stairs and then I looked around, which is not very intelligent. I can see exactly how many gold pieces are in here. That's useful, I suppose. So, hello. We meet again. Did you know that each time you restart a quest, you start at the next to last shop you visited? That's right. If this shop is on floor 19, then the deepest... Then... Wait. That's right. If this shop on floor 19 is the deepest you've been, you'll start at the shop on floor 9 next time. See, so yeah, it's... Oh, there's a bigger... Holy shit, is that expensive. Good lord. For 300 health, 9. Oof. That is a lot of dosh to... Ooh, a mithril sword. <laughs> oh, that's tempting. It's only 300 bucks, too. So we need... Ooh, look at that. Look at that. I want that. Ooh, the cloak. Ooh, it gives me speed. Eh, we'll just grab that. So we should be Amulet of Hesitation. Decreases enemy agility by five. That yeah, sounds reasonably useful. Here you go. What did I, I was gonna say, what else did I buy? I can't even remember that much. So I was kind of thinking too that if you know you're gonna die on the next floor, it seems like it might be a, a good idea to sell your stuff, but also you wanna go to the next floor to see if there's any easy to grab gems which it doesn't seem super likely i've had it a couple times where i go to the next floor and there is a, one of those gems to pick up like right away and not have to kill any monsters so so ooh, got new homies here i've never fought those guys uh, yeah these guys have oh they're very earth resistant and 20 percent earth attack not that I can do anything about it at the moment, but... So what is... Increases your maximum magic power. Contains a ring. Off, ooh, a magic spell. So yeah, any gold chests, any gems... That doesn't sound like the noise that would make. Okay, I'll go with it, though. See a blizzard mage, is that what that said? So yeah, go for gems, yellow chests, and uh, magic spells, apparently. Fire strike! Cast time is half of... Uh, oh, half a second. I was going to say it was half of the water strike, but... 
there anything else? No, not really. Where are the... Oh god, those are very hidden. Do you have any resistance to fire or water? No, you don't. And... Whoosh! Yeah, let's get out of here. Oh, look at all these gems. Holy cow. So I don't think there's necessarily anything to determine how many gems you're going to find because I think I've gone through a floors where there was just one gem in like that set of 9 or 12 or whatever I did and then you have cases like this where there are four of them which I will gladly accept. Is there really any difference in between these? MP cost 7, MP cost 7. No, not particularly. So what are you again? Contains a ring. Don't really need a ring. I'm not spending my MP on anything else, so I might as well just murder what I can. Look at that, another one. Can I even get to that? Increases maximum health. Oh, I can get to that. I can get to that. Hello, Blizzard Mage. So yeah, obviously I wouldn't want to cast Water Strike on him, because he resists 50% of that. Um, I don't know if that's necessarily any better. I'll give it a try, I guess. Good day, sir! Sploosh! <laughs> that sounds like the wimpiest... Just sploosh! The wimpiest attack you can possibly do. It contains a charm. I don't think I care too much. Holy shit, there is a lot going on here. Offhand item, a helmet, some footy footwear... I cannot see the stair. Okay, I cannot see the stairs at all in this background. Get some lizards out of the way. It's like all lizards. I will take it. Uh, what's in here? Anything? An obsidian ring. This gives a lot to everything. Now that's only giving three defense, so I might as well equip that. Dunk. Pardon me, sons. I guess you'd be the other one. What was the other one's name? Papyrus? Is that his name? Something like that. I should play that game. That's a fun game. Uh, I mean, play it on on screen. Oh, uh, if you're wondering what game I'm talking about, that would be Undertale. What was that? The leather booties. And the dinner plate. Let us... No, I didn't want to engage him. I'm trying to conserve MP or conserve HP here. Eh, more grabby hands. I don't care about grabby hands. Or do I? No. No, I don't. Ooh, legendary shield. Not legendary, but you know what I'm talking about. Artifact. So two attack and twenty defense. What is that giving? Oh, wind resistance. I don't care about that. I care about permanence. Right, so I'll use that, and it should be enough to plow through homie here. Oh, God! The fuck did I just do there? I just kicked his ass. Uh, what's the trick of this floor? I don't know if there are mimic chests, so these, these floors kind of... What is that? The silk wristband. Increases agility. I still don't know what's better yet. Let's, in, let's put that on, see what happens. It reduces my damage a little bit, but... Oh well. Yoink. I already have one of those. Thank you very much. It didn't look like there's a big... There's a difference in the items. So, like, once you find, say, the steel gauntlets, all the steel gauntlets are going to be 3 attack and 8 defense. What is... Oh no, a bird. There's always got to be birds. Is he weak to ice or fire? I don't know. I should test test that theory. Uh, can I... I don't need to fight him, so I'm not going to. Weak? Oh, maybe. Sh I don't know how strong this thing is. I don't know. I can't see. He's definitely not... Oh, he's not bad. I like how I say, hey, don't don't gamble with your life. And here I am gambling with my life. Pardon me. 
don't need that. So what is this? This is strength and this is maximum, I think. I really want that strength one. Yeah, I don't like it. Where is... Oh, I thought it got rid of it for some reason. Sploosh! Oh, I should be okay. Sploosh! Hey, alright. Well, hell, I should be able to grab them both in, in this case. As long as I use splooshy attack. He's only doing 9 damage. What am I so worried about? Overly paranoid, I suppose. So yeah, now I really can't do much of anything. But I go to the next floor. Oh, there's a lead. That's exactly why I go to the next floor. Oh, look at that stuff. That's the stuff of happiness right there. So I don't see the stairs again. Oh, they're in the... I'd have to go through just about everything to... Ugh. So I think I should be able to kill this guy. Is he just the same? The Dwarven Caveman! I'll murder him. Just... Oh. Uh-oh. Okay. I'm done. I'm done. I'm sorry. I thought I had more MP than that. Holy shit. That's scary. What's in here? Eh, nothing I care about. So it'd be nice if I could go back to the town and sell all my crap, but there's... not Well, I say town, and there's actually just a little shop, but... So I should be able to get to floor 29 off-screen, and then I will restart from 19. I think we did get some... We did get a couple new things. Yeah, we got a shield and a permanent ring, so that really helped. Oh, right here. Eye of Oceans, and we got the Fire Strike. I didn't pay attention to what the things where did I get any more I need one more in-game medal to get the decorated dungeon diver 15 point badge and I need to find two more artifacts to get the hack and stash badge because we did 121 damage and I have god no idea where the or how or how long it's going to take before we get to the final boss but uh, let's take a look yeah, this is all my garbage, so overall stats. What did we get? Reach floor 20. Escaped with three. Is that like all together? Defeated the master! So yeah, we should be able to get one more artifact, I would hope. At least one per episode, I would be happy at that rate, but once again, that will be a decision for next time, but um, yeah, apparently this is going to take ten episodes at this rate, which is you know, fine by me. Because I actually enjoy this game. It's it's very chill and a little bit it's a little bit risky. I mean it's a it's a roguelike too, so. But yeah, we'll continue on with the Enchanted Cave next time. Let Yeah, that kind of was bass backwards. <laughs> this is Takamasak, I'll see you later.